Yep, south again. East. Uh, I'll try to read it as soon as he gets through it and he, we see he's okay. All right, he just made an East Compton Boulevard. He's on Compton Boulevard from Long Beach. From Long Beach Boulevard, Compton. On Compton, eastbound. Hey, buddy, what's up? So if you guys are watching on the web right now, this is one of the ones where I got to tell you, it isn't like a conflict of interest uh, in, any, in any kind of mean shape or form. I mean, this guy's driving like a maniac. We're watching him. Sheriff's Department, they backed off. They said, this guy's driving too nuts, and he's going to hurt somebody, and we're going to back off. And they did. And now this guy is driving nuts. Uh, he was on Compton Boulevard, just made a southbound turn. And the only reason I'm saying that out loud is because uh, there's an airship, a sheriff's airship, trying to uh, kind of coordinate with us and figure out where they, where, where, the, where this is. Uh, whoa, on so wrong side of the road. Uh, this is the time, like when I'm uh, as a reporter, I need to report, and and if I can get you locations, I can give you a broad stroke. But uh, right now, I really need to watch what this guy is doing. Wrong side of the road, big intersection, Alondra. He's, he's making an eastbound turn on Alondra. Eastbound turn on Alondra. Uh, it looks to be an Audi, uh, a smaller one. It's not the Q7. Maybe uh, if they maybe a Q5. Don't quote me on that. I'm sure somebody out there is. Uh, it, right now, over the 710 freeway, high speeds. Nobody is behind the vehicle as far as law enforcement. Uh, there's a sheriff's ship he uh, helicopter. A sheriff's ship helicopter. It's kind of the same thing. Uh, is kind of getting up overhead right now. Dave, uh, basically over Paramount right now. Uh, there's a helicopter above at this point. You can see this guy still making crazy moves. You know, the, the thing is, is where are you going? I mean, you should be there by now. The way this guy's driving, whatever he's wherever he's going, he should have arrived at that at that location and uh, basically just stopped being such a, a menace to society. But at any rate. He's continuing on now, another southbound turn. I would guess that just from where, looking out the window where we're at, uh, we're just north of the Long Beach area. Cher Cherry Lane? Somebody's saying Cherry? Uh, making another crazy turn, and we're in a residential neighborhood. Uh, so my guess is my statement earlier about him getting somewhere, this might be where he's been trying to get to, passing another car. They were saying earlier on speeds of up to 100 miles an hour on smaller streets, residential, eastbound still. And continuing on right now, this vehicle moving high speeds, extremely small streets out here. It's a neighborhood. Uh, whenever this type of incident is going on, I'm always worried about, obviously, children, Adults, anybody out on the street, dogs and cats running around, you just don't, you just don't know. Another southbound turn onto what appears to be a, uh, some, uh, some kind of smaller street right there, uh, major street. This might be Cherry. Cherry or Orange is what we're guessing right now. And you can get an idea how fast this guy is going. Take a look at that. And, you know, luckily the street he picked right now, not that many cars on it. Uh, but we're... Crossing under the 91 freeway here in just a minute. Boop, there it is, 91 freeway. And waiting for them to pop out the other side. 67th Street. Just a little a little tidbit of information. 67, probably one of my luckiest numbers. Making a turn right there uh, eastbound on 67th Street, paralleling the 91 freeway. Let's see if the, what, this, uh, what that street does for this guy. He's been riding those brakes pretty hard. I mean, he speeds up, he hits those brakes. Whoa! A little bit of a bump right there. Don't know if that's a lease vehicle, but I wouldn't want to be the guy buying it after him. That is for sure. Uh, that was a pretty hard bump right there. High speeds. Another tight turn. Uh, my desk is calling me. I'll be back with you guys in just a moment. Hey there, Simon Desk. What can I do for you? I know. You guys are like on some kind of super major delay. That's all been, that's all, it's all, that's like long time ago, man, long time. But thank you, but thank you for that. Yeah, 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 we're live on the web. I reported it. I said there was an, I'm playing with you. I'm really worried about this. This guy's driving really, really fast, and uh, I'm just afraid he's going to crash into somebody, and I'm having... Obviously, you know, there are no streets for us, and they're not calling anything out, so it's pretty difficult. Got my hands full, and uh, just being hopeful that this guy doesn't crash.
they're 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 watching him right now. I'm pretty sure that's what's going on. They're just watching to see where this guy's going, and he's continuing to drive like a maniac. Yes, yes, there is. Southbound, what do you think this is? Downey? Southbound Downey. Southbound Downey. Uh, back with you guys on the web. Southbound Downey uh, and Audi. Uh, Audi on Downey. Southbound, high speeds, hard turns. Uh, I would guess we're in Long Beach. I don't. Uh, we are Ramona Park. Ramona Park. I'm being serious by that. Ramona Park. <clears throat> continuing on southbound, you know, we're going to be in the Long Beach area. If you guys are listening on the web right now, this is going to be Long Beach area. We're probably on Downey. Solid red coming up, you know. Uh, basically, a lot going on this afternoon. A lot of people asking me questions. A lot of people want to know where we are, what's going on. Uh, made another uh, hard uh, westbound turn. That's the first time we've seen him make a westbound turn in the Long Beach area. You know, this is the first time I'm looking out the window, and there's a passenger in that car. So there's somebody in the passenger seat of this vehicle, which just makes me kind of think to myself, who is sitting in the passenger seat of this car? And, and as any kind of like, yeah, this is great. Keep doing this. Uh, yeah, wow. Uh, another solid red right there. Westbound. Looks like we're on a major road. I would guess maybe South Street. Um, higher speeds out here. And, uh, again, vehicle moving, high rate of speed. Only thing that's chasing them is the uh, helicopter, uh, and that would be the sheriff's helicopter. That's been 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 watching the guy trying to make a turn. Whoa! There we go. Made contact with that guy right there. First time we saw him make a collision, and that Audi just keeps on going. Look at that hit and run. Whoa! Hit and run number two right there. Oh, so just passing Cherry on South Street. We're westbound. Uh, continuing on, saw two collisions in the last couple of minutes. Uh, not a, not, nothing super major, but if it was my car, I'd be furious, that's for sure. These speeds continuing, and, you know, that this is what really worries me, is there are people standing there, walking across the street right there, uh, coming up to another major street right there, southbound on Orange, hard turn, and it's continuing on now, southbound. On Orange, we're definitely in the uh, Santa, uh, in the, the Long Beach area. Audi continues to uh, elude the helicopter. Does it even make sense? I can't even say those words and go. That, that's like nails on a chalkboard. Uh, it's coming up on another solid red light right there, making another crazy hard turn. Parts of the Audi now starting to fall off, uh, making a westbound. It looks like a smaller road, but still a major. It's not like a, like a residential. Uh, it was a westbound turn off of Orange. Uh, continuing on right now. And, uh, yeah, we could be coming up on Long Beach. I'm trying to stay wider and read the map at the same time. Uh, hard on the brakes, making a little bit of a U-turn there. I guess he missed his turn. Maybe he is going somewhere. I, again, I can't understand how he hasn't gotten to where he wants to be yet. Uh, somebody in the roadway right there. Luckily, he did slow down for that person. And, again, making another hard turn on a street. We are in the city of Long Beach. We are in the city of Long Beach, yes. Another hard turn. Looks like he's coming to a stop. They're going to drop off the passenger there. Uh, there we go. The passenger's jumped out. Uh, car's continuing on. Uh, it basically, it looked like a female got off, got out and over there to that apartment complex. Now, let me get you a name of the street. I probably can pull this off. Atlantic. Well, you know, what we know about this car is this guy drives like crazy. Now he's just jumping out, running across the street. We're going to kind of keep this wider shot right now, seeing where he is. There he is. He's underneath the helicopter running the opposite direction, opposite direction behind the trees. And he's continuing on. Well, hopefully we'll get a shot of him right there. There he goes, continuing on, continuing on, northbound on Atlantic. 
Northbound on Atlantic continuing to run. Uh, the sheriff's car is getting a little bit closer. He's making his way into the shrubbery out here. I'd like to say over there by the red or the purple plant, but that's not going to help the officers. Continuing on back across the street, running across Atlantic right now. So that's the first time we got a cleaner shot of this guy. This guy earlier on, we seen two hit and runs with that vehicle. Extremely high speeds, extremely uh, dangerous situation. Uh, you know, this was one of the ones where we're just watching. I was in awe. I, we were on the web for a while there, and I really, truly, I couldn't even speak at some points because it was like, I just was like, what is this guy running for? What is he doing? There he goes. Now he's got his hands up. Officers, dep uh, deputies, excuse me, deputies from the Sheriff's Department. Oh, no, they're not deputies. Those are Long Beach PD uh, right there making contact with that suspect. This is the first time we've actually seen that person. Did drop off somebody. I don't know if we were live when that happened. Dropped somebody off. Appeared to be a female passenger. And that was also, I was just in shock. There's a passenger inside this car making all those crazy moves, driving that crazy. You'd think that that person would have said at some point, hey, I'm not down with this. Slow it down. Right now, though, we've seen two collisions uh, and the suspect now going into custody. Like you said, started in the Carson, Carson area. I was going to say Carson Compton, but in the Carson area, deputies were in pursuit. They gave it up because of the crazy driving. That driving did not slow down. And now coming to an end out here on Atlantic in the Long Beach area, Long Beach PD taking this guy into custody. Uh, well, it, the, you know, the recaps would be just incredibly high speeds, crazy maneuvers, wrong side of the road, many, many times, cutting several vehicles off. It seemed like every light he came to this afternoon was red. He was weaving. He was cutting people off, wrong side of the road, extremely high speeds. At one point, we did see a pedestrian running to get out of the way, you know, with a dog. And then we saw him in neighborhoods, very small neighborhoods, doing those same types of maneuvers. It was incredible uh, that nobody was hurt. Uh, we did see that couple of we did see him make contact collision with two vehicles, basically almost back to back. One of those cars, an SUV, basically hit it as that car doing what he was supposed to do, blinker on, making that right turn into a shopping center, and this guy just crashing into the side of that car. Uh, then a few moments later, while trying to get away from that crash, he sideswipes another car waiting for their light. Uh, that's the wreck. That's what we've been talking about just moments ago. Sorry, I don't have a feed. But th there's a side swipe. That was right after that first collision. So those were almost back to back. That suspect right there causing all this havoc on the roads today. Uh, luckily, nobody se is severely injured. Uh, the car has been left here on Atlantic. That passenger got out uh, just on, off of a smaller street by Atlantic. Long Beach PD in the end here taking this person into custody. Uh, it just got to be clear. The Sheriff's Department Department helicopter well, was over this vehicle almost the entire time. So was there a pursuit? You know, that's a, that's a hard call. But we can tell you there were no reds and blues behind this car while he was driving like a maniac. So if he should have slowed down, he should have done it, but he didn't. And where he was going, gosh only knows, because in the end, he's in cuffs. The, a couple of people's cars are damaged, and so many, so many civilians, so close to injury this afternoon.
Hey, and if you guys are still watching on the web, I'm just letting you guys know that that's the apartment building right there. That's the area where that uh, person was dropped off. And then the car continued on on Atlantic. Uh, in the end, the guy was taken into custody at 51st and Atlantic. If you guys weren't watching, uh, basically what was happening there is he ran back the other way. The car farther down the way, uh, right there, he uh, basically tried to park it. Yeah, he did park it, dropped it, the vehicle right there, and then was running. He ran a good distance back northbound, Long Beach PD taking that guy into custody. We need to see some Sheriff's Department uh, deputies there as well. And then that uh, person that they dropped off, well, you know, it, it, I don't know if there is a uh, uh, crime being committed if you're a passenger in that vehicle. I mean, I don't really know. There don't seem to be making an effort to find that person, uh, but that's the area right there where that uh, that. Uh, what we believe to be a female, uh, get out of the car and uh, basically make their way into that apartment complex or in that alleyway right there. Right now, though, all coming to an end. 51st in Atlantic is where that suspect was taken into custody. Uh, my uh, my pilot, John, rolling his eyes at me a little bit earlier when I said that the uh, helicopter was over it. Uh, they weren't in the beginning. That is, that is a definite. And uh, they were using us, actually, as a beacon to find where this uh, chase was. So at any rate, it, it is over. Thank goodness nobody seriously hurt. And now my desk is calling me. Go ahead, assignment desk. Fifty first and Atlantic. Fifty first and Atlantic is where it ended. That would be Long Beach. Yes, sir, Long Beach. I'll tell him in a second. We have about 40 minutes of fuel, 40 minutes of fuel. Copy all. And if you guys are still watching on the web, what I was just doing right there is for technical talk uh, was what's called a white balance. Uh, you saw the picture got all blue, and uh, I zoomed in on that roof right there that happened to be white, and now it looks more correct again. That's, uh, that's, that's camera stuff. Uh, it's, uh, as the sun goes down, the temperature, the, actually there's a temperature, a light temperature, not the temperature where you go, oh, gosh, it's cold, or oh, gosh, it's hot. It's the color of the light. Uh, changes. If anybody that's a photographer, they all know it. Other people are going, what? But at any rate, that's what I was doing right there. We're on our way to a, uh, a shooting, uh, I don't know if it's a shooting death, but a, a shooting in the city of Santa Monica. Nice neighborhood. Body found between a Bentley and a Ferrari in somebody's driveway. Uh, our desk has been working to get more information on what was going on over there. Don't know if you're going to hear us or see us, but uh, that's our direction right now. Go ahead, assignment desk. Copy. Back to base. Are we still webbing? 